Howdy ho neighborinos, we are here today for the team builder and battle, but right now team builder portion of our ICP battle this week. Um, it's one of the weeks, I can give you that much information for sure. And we're playing Jorge, our fucking homie, and um, yeah, this is going to be a hell of a game man. But he's got Terrakion, Haxorus, Skarmory, Raikou, Diggersby, Drapion, Alcremi, Orbeetle, Magmortar, good old Eggie, and Cramorant. So, <laughs> um, this team, um, he's, he's, man, he's got some real threats here, and it kind of forces me to bring some weird coverage on everything, but, uh, I think I can kind of handle the team. We have Thundy here, and we're just, just right off the bat, dude, we're starting off with Power Herb, U-Turn, Thunderbolt, Super Power, and Fly, just getting just as much damage on poss as possible on everything, just really here to just dent everything you know what i mean it's like you can't we don't have hidden power anymore so you can't really like use your electric types to you know not be set up fodder for stuff so you just run power and fly dude then at least for one turn you're not set up fodder you know next turn might be a problem but for now you're fine um i don't know it seemed fun i have enough um enough special attack investment Oh, I didn't take notes this game. Dude, that's weird. I kept notes the game before this and then the two games after this, but I didn't do this game for some reason. But um, it was for something for sure, man. That's like facts, you know? But it's probably to... That's probably just like to two at KO, like Spadef Skarm or some shit. But um, yeah, man. It's Quinto Un. Now we got Choice Scarf, Jirachi, U-Turn, Moonblast, and Headbutt, and Thunderbolt. This one I know for sure. It just has enough uh, special attack. Also to two hit KO Skarmory, I think that's just Fizz Death, maybe a little bit of mixed action, kind of some shit like that, and then just the rest just dumped into uh, into attack, you know, just to get as much damage out of the uh, the U-turns, the Zen headbutts, and what have you, but um, definitely want something that outspeeds plus one Haxorus, that's like super nice, you want to be obviously, you know, plus one Diggersby is also an issue, and then just Zen headbutt spam late game looks pretty good, if I can catch, uh, you know, Skarm with a T-Bolt or, you know, maybe Haxorus with a Moonblast or something early game. It could help out a lot. So, got a lot of coverage. Got a lot of coverage. Um, good set, but I got to make sure to click the right button. You know, that's a big responsibility sometimes. Next, we got Claydol with the Culverberry. Teleport, Stealth Rock, Earth Power, and Rapid Spin. I was looking at his team and I was like, dude, T-Spikes are so annoying. Drapion's like pretty good here, you know, and... <laughs> What's the only type that, you know, Drapion's weak to? It's fucking ground. <laughs> so it's like Claydol's coming and he's doing his best. You know, Claydol's coming and it's doing whatever it can. You know what I mean? But so we got Culverberry, Teleport, Stealth Rock, <laughs> Earth Power, and Rapid Spin. Uh, just to be able to, we should be able to, even with only four investment, I'm pretty sure we two at KO max HP uh, Drapion. If he's like super spadef, that could be an issue. But uh, Earth Power, two at KOs. We can Rapid Spin. Go, we're, you know we're going to need Rapid Spin. There's a Skarmory and a Drapion and a Diggersby and an Orbeetle on my screen, dude. You can't not bring it. You just can't. And most of those probably beat this 1v1 anyways. But we got we to gotta have the option at least, you know. But um, that's Claydol for you. So at least you can leave, live a, a couple of knockoffs. Get a spin off, maybe an Earth Power or two. Um, and I am actually minus speed nature. And I forgot to change it back because I was originally going to be physical. That I also had uh, Ice Beam, I believe. So it's a whole big thing. And then I just am not fast, you know? Last but not least, we have Focus Sash. Uh, just good old-fashioned lead. SL Gore, Bug Buzz, Spikes, Energy Ball, and Final Gambit. I haven't really done this in a while. I don't know, have y'all noticed? I haven't really been just leading SL Gore. I did it so much in uh, the last two leagues we did that like now it's just like, eh, can I do something else, you know? But I'm bringing it back, dude. Plus, you only need 20 speed and a timid nature to be able to outpace everything on the squad. It's hilarious. So, um, yeah, dude, just get up a spike or two if I can. You know, Gambit if I see a Skarmory in my face, for sure. Uh, I guess it'll also tell me if, like, Diggersby Scarf, a uh, potential Scarf Raikou kind of situation could be a thing, you know. So, um, just designated lead there to obtain information, get up a spike or two, and then just sacrifice his sacrifice his life for the sake of momentum, you know what I mean? Now, when I say this was going to be a hell of a game, it is going to be a hell of a game, and that's all I'll say about it, but I'm bringing Titar and Dracovish one way or another, 
they don't ever really get shown. And I had cool stuff, so I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it, okay? And I don't even, like, know how to describe, like... I don't know how to exp without giving it away, you know what I mean? So let's just... You know what? No, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. It's just fucking... It's stupid. It's you... No. It's nothing. So that is the team builder portion, but you will notice that there's... Yeah, so you get four out of the six, dude. You can't complain. That's two-thirds, man. Come on. That's... It's a good deal. But, um, yeah, that's the team builder portion. I'll see you in the battle. Battle. All right, here we are with the battle versus Jorge. Let's see what we got. We got Raikou, of course. Uh, we got Terrakion. We have Hexorus. Drapion. Um, Orbeetle. And Skarm. Okay, so let's see what he didn't bring. Um, no, all the threats. Cool. <laughs> no Mag... <clears throat> no Mag Mortar. No Eggy. Who is this man I'm playing? No, Creamy, no Diggersby. Okay, that's cool. So he doesn't bring a ground, I mean a, uh, a ground type. Yeah. So no electric immunity, which is really nice because Thundee goes in. Uh, we're going to have to see if Haxorus or Raikou or Terrakion is scarfed. I think Haxorus shouldn't be, but maybe the other two are. Uh, we do just lead our spreadsheet here, get the thing and do the stuff. And if he is, uh, if he leads Orbeetle, which he might, then we probably just click a good old, uh, uh, Bug Buzz. I don't think it'll kill him, but it should do a lot. And then we do have Spin, and he has no Spin Blocker. And, uh, Claydol actually has a decent matchup this game, so that's cool. I already told him in the chat, but good luck. Have fun to our buddy Hort. Well, I said have fun. After what that man did last week, I'm not going to tell him good luck, dude. I think he's got enough. But um, it's our fucking boy Jorge, dude. So we got, uh, you know, we got Battle of the uh, Battle of the Texas. Okay, so he does just lead Haxorus. I'm wondering if it's worth it to just hard fucking gambit, dude. If I just hard gambit, I don't think it's worth it. Bug Buzz is a 2 at KO, so maybe I just throw off a spike and then I can Bug Buzz on the next turn. Do get up a spike. We'll see what he has here. Scale Shot. Okay. Solid bring, solid bring. Now he's plus one speed. Okay, so we know he is jolly. There's not many worlds where we outspeed him here. There's not a lot of worlds where we outspeed him, you know? Um, so I kind of want to go... No, Titar isn't the play. I guess we can just sack spreadsheet, but I really would like to go. I think we just sack spreadsheet, and I can get in. Uh, I can get in Claydol. Click Earth Power. Oh yikes! Hold up. Um, problem. Okay, that does do over half. Gale shot dragon dance, huh? We just click it again. And he misses. And he misses. Oh my god, dude. I am sorry, but also threat averted. You know, Haxorus goes down to a Selgor. Haxorus goes down to a Selgor. We get a spike up. <laughs> what is going on? Uh that was a hell of a set, man. That could have been a problem. Um, that basically would have forced us to sacrifice all the health on Claydol. Pretty much all the health on Claydol, you know? Okay, so he's in with the Tiger. I think this could be Scarf. The way he brought it in, it's gotta be Scarf, right? Um, we're at 87. So... 
kind of just want to... I think I just Gambit here. I think I just Gambit. If he's Scarf, we'll see it. We do just Gambit. I don't want to give him a chance to... Uh, I don't want to give him a chance to set up in my face. So we're just going to Gambit. He does Discharge. Okay. So, we see Discharge. Discharge. Lefties. Okay. So, we could go into Claydol. Um, no, that's not the play. I think we go into Lucky and Bad. Sorry, I'm, I'm fucking everything up here. I did something right before this battle I really shouldn't have. But I think I'm going to go Lucky and Bad. And I'm going to click U-Turn. I could also click Zen Headbutt. Um, with Jirachi versus Raikou. Uh, he does look to be in Zen Headbutt range. Moonblast would be a 2 KO. He could go hard Drapion. If he goes hard Drapion, I'm going hard Tar, I think. So I am just going to click... How much is U-Turn doing? 23 to 27? Let's just click Zen Headbutt. We'll just click it. Oh, he lives on one, and he gets off the Discharge. Ew. Don't? Okay. <laughs> that was scary. So he knows we're Scarf. Uh, he knows we're Scarf. He knows we're Scarf. So I think he's going to be going out into his Drapion. So I'm going to go hard Claydol. We do switch out first. He does withdraw. I'm assuming Drapion comes in here. Yep. Or Colber. Earth Power should do a Kalos. He does take a spike too, which is nice. Um, Claydol versus Drapion. Yeah, Earth Power 2 KOs this. And Knockoff isn't doing much to us because of the Colbert. We're also Max Fizz Def, which is nice. We're actually Max Fizz Def minus Speed because... Oh, he gets up T-Spikes. Okay. T-Spikes versus my Spinner, dude? He is shooketh. And I am not letting those stay there. So let's click Rapid Spin. Feels for Leech Life. Okay. So being plus one, we still don't speed him. So that's fun. I don't know how bulky he is, though. So we can just throw off another Earth Power. I think this one should kill. He could also just go Hard Scarm. He just go for Knock Off. We are Colber. We eating this. Eating this, no prob. And Drapion goes down to Claydol. Um, I wouldn't be surprised to see Orbeetle come in here. Orbeetle is a bit of an issue. If he goes Orbeetle, I think I'm going to have to go Hard Thundee. Excuse me, sorry. Um, ugh, this is... Uh... Okay, we see Scarm. We do, in fact, see a Skarm. Uh, if he defogs, that's going to give us a, uh, a big old boosty boost. So I'm not teleporting. I'm not letting this take any more damage. I am going hard. Thundee. A Soul Gord died to Gambit. I haven't been real suicidal with a Pokemon yet in a while, so... It just, it just felt right, you know? Whirlwind. Okay. Jirachi comes back out. Uh, we have T-Bolt. 
Uh, he probably thinks I'm physical, so I'm just going to click it. Chip on this is amazing. Breaking the sturdy on this is so nice. If he lets me. He lets me. Defog, okay. Okay, so no spike, but... This is doing things and stuff. So, um, I would think he might want to go into Orbeetle on this. So I'm really tempted to go back into Titar. Not back into Titar. I'm tempted to go into Thundee. That should be fine. That way, if he attacks me with like body press or something, uh, it's fine. And if he also goes into Orbeetle, we can click our button. The fact that he defogged, that's weird, man. It's weird. It wasn't, I don't know. We'll see. Going to Big Quinton. He does withdraw. BBB. Better business, Piro. Okay, so he is in with Orbital. I'm assuming this thing is 100% going to be at least max HP. I wouldn't doubt it if it was max defense too. However, we are Power Herb Fly for just such a situation. So we're going to click Power Herb Fly. We're going to just yeet ourselves up. And come flying back down, dude. Just come crashing down with the Wrath of the Gods. Does so much damage. Holy shit. Holy shit, you know? Dude, you know? At this point, everything's in Dracovish range, bro. He's an El Tigre. Okay, that's why he defogged. Makes sense. He gets a little bit more lefties. Um, I do just want to... No, U-turn isn't to play. Here's the thing. I want T-Tar in on this, and I don't want this dead. So I'm going to go... Ugh, actually, I want... Fishy Boy ends this endgame. Fishy Boy ends this endgame, but I think I just need to click U-turn. I'm going to hope he just clicks like... Uh... Oh, he just clicks Shadow Ball. Okay. So hard. Looks like hard tar would have been the play after all. Kinta Un goes for that U-turn. Raikou dies to Thundee. He's got Terrakion, Orbeetle, and Skarmory in the back. Orbeetle's at like 25%. Skarmory's at below half. Um, This will force in Terrakion. Do I want Terrakion in? I don't have a good switch into Terrakion. I'm going Lucky and Bad. We just go Lucky and Bad. We just go lucky and bad. And if he is Scarf Terrakion, this will reveal that. Goes in the C-Wing. Is he trying to bait out the T-Bolt? Um, I don't think I mind. Although Terrakion being right there is a little unfortunate. So I think I'm going to U-turn. He does withdraw. Okay, yep. Into Terrakion? No, into BBB. Okay, so he wanted... Basically, he wanted to sack... Does this kill this? It kills it. <laughs> Orbital goes down to Jirachi. Orbital goes down to Jirachi. I guess we go Kinto Un now. Yeah, we just go Kinto Un. Pretty much, I think. He goes into Moose, which is Terrakion. All right, so he can't Rock Polish and Swords Dance in the same turn, luckily. Uh, Superpower does the most to this guy. Um. Thunderbolt does a little bit over half. I think I just click superpower here. Did 
does a lot. He does go for rock polish. Oh, this boy getting Polish, huh? Well, I tell you what, I'm glad he's not a uh, weakness policy, or this would have been a bad day. He's going go for the edge. He's going to miss the edge. Gorey, I'm sorry, dude. I'm hacking the shit out of you. Um, he has every right to just call me whatever name he wants, and I will understand that that's just him being authentic, dude. You know? Try here and goes into Sunday. And oh, he has a scarm in the back. This was just a shitty game. Um, lucky and bad gang never fails, I guess. Um, yeah, man, you hate to see, you hate to see a homie go down like this. But in, in all, like, you guys know on this channel, we're very uh, introspective about balance. And I don't mean the play style. I mean balance as in uh, the universe working things out. I think this might have been the universe being like, hey. Uh, Sheldon needs some diff, and you had a really good week last week because of us, so we're just gonna pass that along. You know, it's like, dude, this is the fucking, this is the, <laughs> this is the take a penny, leave a penny fucking lucky and bad game of the week, dude. Take a penny, leave a penny, lucky and bad game of the week, dude. You heard it here first. I'm gonna unregister from fucking please, and I gotta go just apologize to Jorge, dude. This is my Texas homie, dude. We're both in Texas right now. This is our first week of 100 plus degree weather in Texas right now, dude. We're supposed to be sticking together. We're not supposed to be hacking people. We're supposed to be, you know, passing out space blankets or I guess that wouldn't really what you be what you want when it's hot outside. You would want like water or like ice or something. I don't know, but basically we're supposed to be helping each other. I imagine like running through a sprinkler on a front lawn or something, you know. We're not supposed to be just ruining people's days you know <laughs> oh that's so unfortunate i'll take a 5-0 though dude my diff's kind of shit right now so i'll take a 5-0 uh again i'm sorry to jorge um it's a great game we play you know it's a great game we play and once again i guess this is my catchphrase now but i am sorry i really am however not sorry enough to forfeit so that's just that's just the game dude this is pokemon i've had my shit pushed in by you know hacks before so uh this is just what happens man so like subscribe do all that bullshit definitely 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 check out jorge that man makes the best thumbnails i know you might be thinking of a person in your head that's like no they make pretty good thumbnails too nobody makes thumbnails like jorge does dude and i can't wait to see what this thumbnail is gonna be oh my god this is gonna be the best worst thing like the fucking, the turn one, or the turn three or whatever, with the uh, Haxorus missing, we still beat that, I believe, but we lost all the health on our clay doll, you know what I mean? So, uh, we wouldn't have had that, we probably would have had to play the game with T-Spikes up, which would have meant relying on Thundee and Jirachi, but I guess they kind of beat everything anyways, I don't fucking know anymore, man. Obviously, you can't play Shoulda, Woulda, Coulda, Mons, I've already done the outro, I shouldn't even be talking anymore. Who am I? Who are you? You know what I mean? Bye forever.